What's up, everyone? I'm here at Splunk's .conf 2025 in Boston, Massachusetts. This year at .conf, we're showcasing digital resilience in the era of agentic AI, new products, and how to unlock the full value of your data. We caught up with executives, customers, and well, it wouldn't be a .conf without Buttercup. Let's dive into what's new in the world of AI. We're kicking off with next generation architecture designed to unlock the full value of machine data for AI. Cisco Data Fabric helps organizations turn complex fragmented machine data into AI ready intelligence, allowing businesses to become faster, resilient and make smarter decisions. Here's G2 Patel to tell us more. It's a completely brand new concept. And let me walk you through what the three things are that this revolutionary architecture does. Number one, it actually operates machine data at ludicrous scale. And by the way, we've always done things at very high scale. But I think it's not been efficient every single time on doing some of these things. So let, 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 let's talk about that. Number two, we want to make sure that we can unlock your proprietary data for your AI. Because unlike in human-generated data, we had enough kind of publicly available data in the public internet that you could train the models with. With machine data... It's typically pretty proprietary, right? And so you want to make sure that you can actually use that data to glean insights. And thirdly, we want to make sure that we can unify the experiences for the humans and agents. Moving on to observability, Cisco and Splunk are setting a higher standard for monitoring and managing digital environments. Splunk observability now features agentic AI and unifies data across networks for complete visibility. These new AI-driven capabilities are essential for enterprises looking to adopt and scale AI responsibly and reliably. We caught up with two special guests to talk more about observability. And as we bring on these new AI and agent agentic tools, that digital landscape gets even more complex, and that we're sensing that there's this like non-human scale problem that's starting to emerge, that organizations are looking to companies like Splunk and Cisco to say, are there tools you can help me bring on that are going to make my teams more productive, and that you're going to allow me to use this data I've been collecting for a number of years to actually become a competitive advantage. Security is vital when it comes to digital resilience and AI. Splunk shares new enhancements to their security portfolio with Splunk. Splunk Enterprise Security Essentials and Splunk Enterprise Security Premier, keeping pace with evolving threats and maximizing value. Teams can be effectively streamlined with threat detection, investigation, and response. Here's more on the importance of security. If you think about safety and security for AI, the future of the SOC is going to be agentic. You'll see some really exciting announcements tomorrow about the future of the SOC being agentic. But what we've also got is the ability to now secure AI itself. So when you have a model or when you have a whole slew of models that you're using within your organization, how do you make sure that you can have a consistent substrate of security that goes across all the models so that regardless of which model you use, you can have some degree of predictability in the behavior? That requires that you have the right level of visibility. That requires that you have the right level of validation of the model and then can apply runtime enforcement guardrails. And we do that with AI defense, which is now fully integrated into Splunk. So you're starting to see a fair amount of kind of innovation that's happened over the course of the past 12 months. We caught up with Splunk's Kamal Hathi to tell us more about digital resilience and AI. AI itself can be a risk, as you said. Mm -hmm. You know, you can have much faster threats coming in, new kinds of threats. But AI is also this revolution, it's an opportunity. And so what we're doing, and we talked about this in the keynote, is this notion of fighting fire with fire, right? This idea that AI itself is going to be the tool that provides against, against AI. Yeah. So as AI moves at machine speed, machine scale, we provide the tools for our customers to also move at machine speed and machine scale, yeah. and we enable this. So this is the idea that, you know, you really need to provide this, 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 the core of your systems had to be plumbed in with AI so that anything that comes up, can be, can, we can react to it. We also got to catch up with Ticketmaster to hear the importance of Splunk technology. We've been using Splunk for nearly two decades. Uh, I think it's probably fair to say that Splunk is, it's our organizational DNA, it's just how we think. For an organization like us, it's really important for us to be able to respond to anomalous behavior 
if there's anything which looks surprising or looks unusual, we need to be able to take action really fast. Whether that's in the heat of an on-sale or during an entry period of time, we have to be able to respond really fast. And Splunk gives us that ability through the ability to correlate logs and traces in real time. That's a wrap on this Splunk special Cisco News Now. For more information, head to newsroom.cisco.com and we'll see you in the next video.